two HSI agents who work here at the Federal Building behind me uh, were shot inside the office. One of the agents died at the scene. A second agent suffered multiple gunshot wounds and was rushed to a local hospital. The wounded agent is Deputy Special Agent in Charge Kevin Kozak. Mr. Kozak is one of my two deputies here in Los Angeles and reports directly to me. He remains hospitalized in stable condition at this time. His family, colleagues, and friends are with him. He is alert and talking. Agent Kozak is alive today because of the heroic actions of a third ICE supervisor. While that agent's quick thinking saved Agent Kozak's life, it also meant one of his colleagues died. The deceased agent was Supervisory Special Agent Ezekiel Garcia, who was 45 years old and served as a supervisor of the HSI-led Document and Benefit Fraud Task Force. We still are characterizing this as an incident of workplace violence. So as you've heard, two federal agents who we now know as Kevin Kozak and Zeke Garcia were having a discussion in the ICE office uh, at about 5.30 p.m. last night. As we understand it, Mr. Kozak was counseling Mr. Garcia with regard to his performance. Based on the interviews and the evidence, we believe there was an escalation in this discussion which likely led Mr. Garcia to fire several rounds from his service weapon, uh, hitting Mr. Kozak. Uh, as you know, Mr. Kozak is currently hospitalized, and I'm happy and relieved to say that he is uh, in stable condition. According, after Mr. Garcia began firing, another agent working nearby intervened and fired his weapon to prevent additional rounds being fired by Mr. Garcia.